Now at six, would you consider this a healthy lunch for a child who needs protein to get through the school day? Parents who reached out to RTV6 definitely do not. So we're investigating what's going on here. RTV6 is Stephanie Wade is holding one district accountable for what parents are calling a very lacking lunch offering. Some parents weren't happy to see that their child was being served two breadsticks as their main entree for lunch. But after digging into federal regulations, I found that what the school is offering students is within federal guidelines. I just couldn't believe that you could actually just give them regular breadsticks, you know, it has no nutritional value. A parent whose child is in kindergarten and wants to remain anonymous wasn't happy when his daughter was served breadsticks, carrot coins, and applesauce for lunch. A lot of kids, that's their only meal of the day. They don't get to go home and have that nice meal that a lot of our kids are blessed with. But according to the Indiana Department of Education, this is allowed because the district offers cheese dipping sauce along with the breadsticks. This fulfills the requirement. Cheese, uh, per the USDA, is considered a protein, um, and therefore we see schools that offer that sometimes as a protein. But some parents in the district think kids should have a more well-rounded meal to get children through the school day. I took those concerns to the Greenfield Central Schools superintendent, and he tells me he is open to making adjustments to menu items and reiterates they always comply with federal regulations. Working for you tonight, Stephanie Wade, RTV6.